Know that one of you is the evil smell switcher. So come on, fess up. Excuse me, Chief Inspector, but we seem to have company. Ah, thank goodness you're here. I'm Little Monster, Private Eye, and this is Detective Kerplapis. Charmed, I'm sure. We're trying to solve a very smelly mystery, and we need your help. Indeed. If you want to help us solve the smelly mystery, Click the play button. If you want the chief inspector to read you the story, click the read button. If you want to look at a page, click the page button. If you'd like to try your skills at the mugshot game, click the mugs button. If you'd like to try and solve the smelly mystery again, click on the new button. It's your move, detective. It all started the night of the sleepover at Yaldi's house. It was the usual gang. Little laugh. Icky. All right, radical. Erg. Hey, Erg, quit it. <laughs> I always knew you were a drip. Jerry Bombanat. Hey, Yally. Did you know that absolute zero is the temperature at which the molecules of a substance would cease moving? Hmm. That's nice, Jerry. Yelly, of course. <laughs> and myself. You know, boys and girls, having your friends sit over really is a lot of fun! I love sleepovers! <laughs> go team, go! Go team, go! You'll scare the children. Sorry, Mom. What happened? They got me, Nikki. The cavities, they got me. Hey, Lou, I'm gonna get you out of here. No, no, it's too late, Nikki. I'm a gone. Yeah, yeah, but you, you still have time. Time to brush your teeth twice a day. And Nikki, never forget the floss. Now beat it. <laughs> See ya, Penny. Pick it up. Give it to me. You'll have good luck. Ho, 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 ho.
trick or treat. Wow, I got cinnamon bon goo goos. Hey, all I got was a rock. Hey, Erg, your feet stink. They smell good to me. <laughs> This is Major Nelson to Houston. I've left the capsule to have a look around. Not strange terrain, but the atmosphere is all right. I think this place is perfect to colonize. Holy moly! Back inside. Abort the mission. I repeat. Abort the mission. <laughs> Here. You want a piece of gum? Huh? Hmm? Oh, gum. Give me some. Ouch! <laughs> I must break you. Ella, go for it. Adrian, I love you. Would you like to have a leak of my cinnamon farm Google? Uh, thanks. But like, no thanks, dude. It's like got your germs all over it. Oh, gross. You're going down tonight, dude. Bad chance, surfer boy. Get him, Mickey! Knock his brains out! Hey, cut it out! I'm trying to read my book. I said quit it, fromage for brains. What'd you call me? Okay, boys, it's time to go to sleep. Good night, Good night, Good night you. Yellow 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 Good night, Mom. Good night, boys. Sleep tight. Don't let the zipper up bite. Good night, The next day, I didn't stay for breakfast at Yally's. I had to get home to the office.
Suddenly, the phone rang. Little Monster Private Eye Headquarters. Detective Kerplop is speaking. Uh! It's for Chief Inspector. It was Mrs. Yalapapas, and she was very upset. Ah, something terrible has happened to my lunch. The orange juice smells like peanut butter, and the peanut butter smells like orange juice. Ah, please come right away. Don't worry, Mrs. Y. We'll be there in two shakes of a toad's tail. Detective Kerplopis to the private eye mobile on the double. Yes, Chief Inspector. So he sped to Yalapapas Manor. Watch out, Chief Inspector. There's a stop sign up ahead. <laughs> no problem. Whew. Oh no, Detective Kerplopis. Now what? Don't worry, Chief Inspector. I'll just dial 1-800-GREASE. And hello, Grease Monkey. Hello, Grease Sorry, old chum. I was looking for the windshield wipers. Well, I must say, that was quite a rush, Chief Inspector. Ooh! I love a good mystery! So mysterious! Goodbye, little monster. I hope you remember to wear a clean pair of underwear. Such a fresh and rich and fresh and sidewalk. <sighs> Hello, sir. I am Ed McMonster, and I have a publisher's haunted house sweepstakes check for ten billion dollars. Just for you. You hear that, Mabel? We're rich. Ah, Marty Flatbush, a billionaire. Marty Flatbush? Ho ho ho! I am incorrect, sir. I am looking for a Monty Feldspar. Good day. Get him, Butchie. Kill. I'll get you, my pretty, and your little grandpa's too. <laughs> Forget to watch the speed limit, Chief Inspector. Uh, oh, oh, where is he? Uh, what are we going to do? Uh. When I got to the scene of the crime, I knew it had to be the work of the evil smell switcher. Little monster, private eye here. Oh, thank goodness you're here. So, the orange juice smells like peanut butter, and the peanut butter smells like orange juice. Uh, yes! Someone must have switched the smells last night at the sleepover. So don't leave town, any of you. You're all suspects in the smelly mystery. What? Hey, 
If you want to find out more about each of the suspects, click on the magnifying glass. Uh, good morning, folks. This is your captain speaking. Uh, we're going to be cruising at about 30,000 feet on our way to Monsterville this afternoon, uh, taking in the sights. Uh, hope you enjoy yourselves. Uh, the uh, beverage cart going to be around very soon. Uh, excuse me, but I'm going to have to ask you to return to your seat right now. Thank you. Café es muy bueno. He said, my coffee is very good. Si. I, Two Star, shall rule the kitchen, and no one can stop me. Not if I can help it. Percolator, I'd like to make a toast to your destruction. Have a slice of my whole wheat badness. No, thank you. I'm not hungry. No taste some freshly brewed justice. You may have won this round, Percolator, but I'll pop up again when you least expect it. I'll always know when trouble is brewing because justice is always wide awake. Ah. Hey, Spaghetti! What? Um, when's a jar? Not a jar. When? When it's closed! Hey, do you mind? Close that door! How do you do? I'm here to introduce the amazing Wonder Vac, the same vacuum cleaner the astronauts use. Hey, I'm not finished yet. Jelly, would you like some jam, huh? Mm, yeah. Thank you, little Raph. <laughs> ah! Erg, that's my cake. Uh, sorry, Jerry. Hey, Jerry, what's that you're eating? Peanut butter and cheese. Oh, let me try some of that. Mmm, cheese. Hey, make your own sandwich. Be careful how much of that stuff you use, Icky. It's very hot, you know. I know, dude. I like living on the edge. Whoa! Radical! You got any threes? Uh, nope. Go fish. Chief Inspector, there seems to be something on the fridge. Aha! A clue! It appears to be a handprint. I'll take a picture of it with my super-duper infrared spy camera. Drafts. The handprint is blurry. Looks like this clue is a real question mark. Don't worry, Chief Inspector. I'll send the film to the lab. We should have a clear photograph of it by the end of the day.
Good idea, detective. Now smile and say cheese. Cheese, Chief Inspector. Just testing out my anti-gravity watch, Chief Inspector. I'll have the thing back in its proper place in a jiffy. Hmm. I wonder if there's any good food, I mean evidence, in the fridge. I think I'll investigate. Knock, knock. Who's there? Butter. Butter who? Butter not turn around. Hello, man! <sighs> what? What do you get when you cross a cat and a lemon? I don't know. What do you get when you cross a cat and a lemon? A sourpuss! Oh, grow up. Jelly. Jelly baby, where are ya? I'm stuck over here. We gotta get out of this jam, sweetie. Don't worry, Peanut Butter. One day we'll be together. Anthony! It's the Monster Spaghetti Day! Look out! Thank you, Chief Inspector. You almost had the jump on me. Don't thank me, Detective. Thank my trusty boomerang hat. Thank you, trusty boomerang hat. Orange juice, please. Mm hmm? Hmm. Orangey, with a subtle hint of peanut butter. Mm -hmm. Peanut butter, please. <laughs> I just don't understand it. Why would anyone switch the smells? 
That, Mrs. Yellowpapis, is exactly what we're going to find out. Detective Kerplopis, we must go. It is time to put our noses to the grindstone, as they say. Right here, Chief Inspector. Detective Kerplopis and I went back to the office to review the case. And now, Detective Kerplopis, let's start with the suspects. Ahem. Well, Chief Inspector, since the crime happened during the sleepover, it must have been committed by someone who was there. Therefore, the suspects would include the following. Little Laugh. Icky. Jerry Bombanat. Erg. Yally. And yourself. <laughs> Nick. Afraid so. As you yourself always say, Chief Inspector, everyone is guilty until proven innocent. Yes, you are right. That is what I always say. That is why I am the Chief Inspector. I got a delivery here for Little Monster. That's me. I'll take that. Okay, fellas, gotta go. I'm double parked. You got yourselves a nice day. What a peculiar fellow. Hmm. I wondered who could be sending me flowers. Perhaps you have a secret admirer, Chief Inspector. Why don't you read the card? I don't think there is one. Oh, what's that awful smell? Eh, ugh. The flowers. They smell like rotten eggs. Quick, the window. This evil smell switcher is more dangerous than we thought. We'll have to stay on our toes, Detective. Like walking on eggshells, Chief Inspector. Suspect number one, Little Lap. Monsterville's resident practical joker. And quite a good one at that. Hand buzzers. Water buckets. You name it. Little Laugh has done it. He's always looking to top himself, making each joke he plays better than the last. And switching the smells in Monsterville would be quite the practical joke indeed, Chief Inspector. Yes, indeed, chum. Suspect number two, Erg. Erg has been a rebel since the day he hatched. He talks tough, dresses cool, and is always looking for trouble. He also has a passion for food, always wanting to try something new, something different. And what could be more different than food that smells like something else? Right on, Detective! Suspect number three. Icky's his name, and danger is his game. Icky spends his time engaged in high-risk sports, like surfing, rock climbing, and snowboarding. He thirsts for the syrupy nectar of adventure and would do anything to taste it. Even resort to a crime, like switching smells. Exactly. Suspect number four, Gerard T. Bombanac, chemistry buff, scientific genius. Winner of the Monsterville Elementary Science Fair five years in a row. If anybody, he would be the most capable of creating the smell-switching device. Perhaps he intends to use the smell-switching device as his entry to this year's fair. He'd be guaranteed to get his hands on another medal. If he's the smell-switcher, the only medal he'll be getting his hands on is that of my handcuffs. Suspect number five. Yally Yallapapis. Yally may look like a donut on the outside, but he sure isn't stuffed with jelly. Yally has always desired to live the life of a secret agent. He's seen every James Bombinat film ever made. And he fancies himself to be quite the master of disguise. Perhaps he's through playing pretend. And his secret mission is to mix up the smells of Monsterville. Correct again, old friend.
I don't see how you possibly think I had anything to do with this, detective, but I'd like to hear your theory. I must say, I was quite a cute baby. Indeed, Chief Inspector. Now, if you will allow me to explain. Quite frankly, we haven't had a case in months. Not since we were hired to find Mrs. Peavish's cat. Perhaps this smell-switching mystery is just a scheme you cooked up to give yourself something to do. Well, I'm impressed, Detective. Very good reasoning indeed. It seems I do have a motive. Although I assure you of my innocence, I will allow you to entertain your thoughts. It's good practice for you, Detective. Here's looking at you, kid. behind this molar? I don't know. Aliens, the caffeinated man, flesh-eating parasites. The evil smell switcher? Don't be silly, Skelly. This is a conspiracy. There's something out there. Molar! At last, the Maltese Crooney will be mine! <laughs> <laughs> Better luck next time, sweetheart. Mad Dog! Yeah? What did the football player say to the ref after the coin toss? Uh, I don't know. Give me my quarterback! Ha 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 ha! I don't get it. Ah, uh, nuts. Hold on, chum. I'll get you out of there in a jiffy. Please do, Chief Inspector. Sorry about that, Detective. Remind me, I have to get that thing fixed. Indeed you do, Chief Inspector. Indeed you do. Hi, this is Little Monster, Private Eye. We can't come to the phone right now because we're on a case. But leave a message after the beep and we'll get back to you. Thank you. Hello, I'm looking for Sally Kramer. Huh? Nobody there by that name, huh?
Little Monster, it's time for your nap. <coughs> Detective Kerplopis and I went to bed for our nap. When suddenly something smacked into my bedroom door. Look, Chief Inspector. It was none other than a note from the evil smell switcher. Beware. I'm going to mix up every smell in town. And you can't stop me. Shined, the evil smell switcher. Let's examine the hallway for clues, detective. <laughs> I can't smell a thing, Chief Inspector. He must have switched the smell of his trail. Ah, he's a clever fiend. I'll give him that. <laughs> Chief Inspector, I think I found something. Smells like lemon fish. A sparkling yellow thirst-quenching variety of pop. Very popular with the younger crowd, Chief Inspector. Put it in the evidence bag, Detective, and mark it. Exhibit A. Hey, Archie! It says here that Martian Eskimos have abducted Elvis Monster and are cloning him for strip mining on Venus. How many times have I told you not to read that trash, huh? Now where's my chips and walk a holy moly dip? Oh no! You're not eating that garbage! Let me get your dinner ready! Well, hurry up, huh? Is this little monster pizza? No, this is Little Monster Private Eye. Yeah, that's what I want, a pizza pie. Okay, I have a large with pepperoni. No, no, I said Private Eye. That's what I said, a pizza pie. Sorry, sir, you have the wrong number. And remember, if I don't get that pie in half an hour, it's free. Good shot, chum. Thank you, Chief Inspector. Hello? Monster Residence? Who's calling? <coughs> Baba Monster? Just a minute, please. I'm sorry, but the Chief Inspector and Detective Kerplopis have stepped out right now. Wow. I'll tell him he called. Good day. <coughs> All right. Where were you on the night of April the 26th? I was next to you. A likely story. Well, do I get my phone call? Sure. But make it snappy. Uh, the, the, the line's busy. Tell it to the judge. All of this detective work has made me famished, Chief Inspector. Me too, but I've got just the thing. A garlic and ketchup sandwich with pickles. Ooh, quite delicious, Chief Inspector. There's enough garlic in here to ward off a vampire. Let's go, Detective Kerplopis. Right here, Chief Inspector. After you, Detective Kerplopis. After you, 
Chief Inspector. I insist after you. No, after you. The evil smell switcher didn't stop there. When we went down to the kitchen, we discovered that the salad smelled like perfume. Oh no! The salad smells like perfume! And we can't eat it! It must be the work of the evil smell switcher. The evil smell switcher? <clears throat> Mom, I'd like to ask you a few questions. Where exactly did you buy this salad? At the grocery store. Aha! The grocery store to the private eye mobile, Detective Kerplopis. Right here, Chief Inspector. <laughs> Just as I suspected, the evil smell switcher had struck at the grocery store. Everything smelled like something else. Oh, I'm ruined! Everything smells like something else. Does my nose deceive me? Or are all the smells in Monsterville mixed up? Little monster private eye here. Don't worry about a thing, citizens of Monsterville. We're in hot pursuit of the evil smell switcher, and we'll catch him before the day is through. The, the evil, evil smell switcher! God zooks! Detective, did you investigate over by that... Whoa! Chief Inspector, are you all right? There seems to be some gum stuck to your foot. Ah, but this is no ordinary gum. I believe it is the next clue. Experiment. Very refreshing. Only the evil smell switcher would be rude enough to throw his gum on the floor where someone might step on it. Those are some fine-looking tomatoes you got there. Fresh. It's two outs and two strikes in the bottom of the ninth. The count is two and two. Here's the wind-up. There's the pitch. And he's out! Monsterville wins the game! Holy cow! Come on, you smelly carploppers. Try and hit me. You got nothing. Come on, you sissy. Dunk me. You spineless, you yella. Toss me a tomato, Chief Inspector. Uh-oh. Whoops! And lucky throw. Nutty nuggets, nutty nuggets. When they hit your ball, you lose control. Over nutty nuggets. Cash a credit? Pickles of tomatoes? Paper or plastic? I just can't take it anymore! Ah! <laughs> After him! Yes, Chief Inspector!
We chased that evil smell switcher all the way to the fish market. But we were too late. All the fish smelled like candy. Excuse me, sir. Which way did the evil smell switcher go? I reckon that varmint went that away. Now wait a minute. I think he went the other way. No, he went that way. No, he didn't. He went that way. He went that no, away. He went no, way. he went that, that way. way. I believe he went that way. <laughs> Silence, everyone. The chief inspector is trying to think. <coughs> chief inspector, there seems to be something stuck in that shark's throat. Let's take a look, detective. Hey, it's another clue. A baseball mitt. A well-oiled baseball mitt, I must say, Chief Inspector. This mitt has seen more than its share of balls. It looks as if our smell friend has quite a fondness for the great monster pastime. Okay, okay, okay. Say, peppermint! Mmm, peppermint! Take a tuna and make a liquid fish. The smell switcher can. The smell switcher can. The smell switcher can. Who can take a sardine and make it sugary delish? The smell switcher can. The smell switcher can. The smell switcher can. One fish burger, please. That'll be a buck twenty-five, mister. I'll gladly pay you Tuesday for a fish burger today. Look, buddy. That line may work on sailors, but not on me. Some party down there. Be more careful where you swim, my dear. Now run along. The smell switcher's getting away, my boy. The smell switcher's getting away. So let's set sail, no we're hard on his trail. Now let's get moving, I'd rather be grooving. The smell switcher's getting away, my boy. The smell switcher's getting away. That smell switcher, he's got to pay. Let's save the dancing for another day. Let me 
out of here. I was framed. Penny I tells him. Something smells fishy. You're not gonna send me up the river. I didn't do it. Pipe down in there or you're all gonna be in hot water. Yes, sir. Oh no! It sounds like the evil smell switcher! I think it's coming from somewhere over there! Follow me, Chief Inspector! Ah yes, chum! After all, you are the best sniffing Kerplopis around! Right here, Chief Inspector! <laughs> We followed the evil smell switcher to the flower shop. But guess what the flowers smelled like? Fish! <laughs> oh no! He's dead! What could have killed him, Chief Inspector? <laughs> Aching nose. So, you're not dead. Nah, I'm not dead. But these fishy flowers are just about killing me. <laughs> All right, listen up, people. We've come to free you from the oppressive aromas of the evil smell switcher. Now, if you'll just fall in single file and proceed up the- Ugh! The smell! The smell! All units, retreat! Retreat! Chief Inspector, I think there is something in the cactus plant. Aha! It may be the next clue! Tangos! A juicy fruit made from pears and tangerines. A popular lunchbox item. Smells scrumptious. I mean, smells like yet another savory addition to the evidence bag, Chief Inspector. Oh, one last sniff. Oh, give me one last sniff. I never took a whiff. That smells so much like fish. Oh, 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 give me one last sniff. Oh, one last sniff. Oh, you smell like perfume. <laughs> Before this afternoon. Now you smell like fish. But if I had one wish. Oh, 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 oh give me one last sniff. Out goes Daisy, ride her bicycle. Oh. By using her... petal. Ooh. That joke stinks. <laughs> Oh, that was like butter. Oh dear. Here I go. I'm getting all the clamp. Talk amongst yourselves. I'd like to be part of a bridal shower. Hmm. That's too fancy for me. 
I fancy myself as being part of a bouquet. What if I was part of a fundraiser at school? Oh, that's for a good cause. What do you call a monster who lays on the floor? You call him Matt. I think we're going about this case all wrong, detective. Let's try looking at it from another point of view. Good idea, Chief Inspector. Who loves ya, baby? Hmm. This doesn't seem to be working either. And the smell seems to have gotten the lads all spooked, Thomas. Hey, there's something stinky going on here. Yeah, man. I'm sorry, Chief Inspector, but I seem to have lost the scent. The fish, uh, aroma, has overpowered the evil smell switcher's trail. The evil smell switcher has struck again. Where? At Shea Monster, the finest restaurant in town. They say the roast chicken smells like bubblegum, and the dinner rolls smell like soap. Yikes! Holy olfactory senses! Fear! Little monster private eye is here! Ow! Ow! Sorry, Chief Inspector. Quite all right, Detective. Sure enough, at the finest restaurant in town, the chicken smelled like bubblegum. Little monster private eye here. Don't anybody move. This is a crime scene, and you might be tampering with valuable evidence. Did you say crime scene? That is correct. A very smelly crime has been committed here. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Hmm. There's a suspicious looking smudge here, detective. Hand me the dusting powder, please. Dusting powder, Chief Inspector. <coughs> Aha! What is it, Chief Inspector? Footprints. And they look to be just the evil smell switcher's size. Shall we dance? Mais bien sûr, mademoiselle. Not bad, detective. Civilization. How droll. Everything is so stinking. In the smell of mystery. Baby, I can't you see? I'm gone crazy. Someone in this misery. Ow! Here is the Napoleon you ordered for dessert, monsieur. Sacre bleu! This Napoleon seems a bit spoiled. Could you send it back, please? But of course, monsieur. It's so unusual to smell like bubblegum It's so unusual
What a hunk! Hello, Shelly. Mm, my baby. Mm, my sweet. Ooh. Click on each suspect to find out about his favorite things. And then, match them up with the clues you find to figure out who done it. Show. Hey, why not give it a chance? Come with me twice and breathe. There's so many things to see. The Eiffel Tower is hardly showers, and the wine is never sour. So come to France, come to France, come to France. Bravo, Chief Inspector, bravo. Pardon me, but do you have any French fries? No, we do not, sir. Well, how about French toast? No, we do not sell French toast. Well, how about some French onion soup with a scoop of French vanilla ice cream? Absolutely not. Huh. I thought this was a French restaurant. I cannot possibly eat that chicken. It smells like bubblegum. I'm sorry, madame, but the flavor is rather unique, no? A true culinary experience. Bah humbug! Throw that chicken in the garbage! Garbage! That's it! To the private eye mobile pronto! Next stop, the garbage dump! My hunch was right. The evil smell switcher had been to the garbage dump. All the garbage smelled lovely. Hey, hey get a whiff of this. It smells so nice. Mmm. Ooh, you smell as sweet as the garbage, dear. <laughs> Hmm, this certainly doesn't belong here. It's too new. Chief Inspector, I found something. I believe it's the next clue. Good work, chum! Ah, a game monster video game. Super Lala Brothers. Hard to find, but very good. Our smell-switching friend must be quite a gamer. Wow, it smells good!
still can. Uh, hey, buddy, what happened to you? Arr, I was struck by lightning. <laughs> so you could say you're a barge with charge. <laughs> Why, you... Ow! Uh, hey, buddy, what happened to you? Arr, I was struck by lightning. <laughs> The lovely smell switcher. See the birds suddenly appear Now that the stench has left the air Fragrantly it seems to be something new A word smell, yes it's pretty Watch your step. Well, sorry, kitty. Oh, what a beautiful dump. We'll dine on some junk. We're walking through a garbage wonderland. Hey, buddy. How'd you end up here? <coughs> I got thrown out of a window. Thrown out of a window? <laughs> what for? <clears throat> My owner wanted to see time fly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that hurts. <laughs> We've lost the trail, Chief Inspector. We cannot give up yet, Detective. There he goes. It's the evil smell switcher. Let's make like bananas and split, detective. <laughs> the evil smell switcher is nowhere to be found. It looked as if we had met our match, until we got the next clue. Sorry folks, but this road is closed until we figure out what smells so funny. you! I can't believe it! All the smells in my mouth are really mixed up! Hey! This soda smells funny! Buddy, all my soda smells funny. Now, before you all set out to pull off this job, I'm gonna give each of you a code name. You're Mr. Kraut, you're Mr. Mustard, and you're Mr. Relish. Uh, Joe, uh, I don't like Relish. Uh, can't that be Mr. Ketchup instead? No. I got another guy in a cart down the block named Ketchup. Your relish! Joe, you know I just got out of the cooler. I don't want to get into any hot water. Don't be yellow, Mustard. Look, I'm going to be frank with you. Just keep your nose clean and don't spill the beans. You'll do fine. Now get your buns out of here. Okay, okay, okay. Now let me tell you guys what the lyrics to the Oscar Monster hot dog jingle really mean. <laughs> Every smell you change, every odor you rain, every smell that strains Joe isn't quite the same. I'll be smelling.
Hey everybody, it's the Dan Crunion. Dan Crunion. Dan Crunion. Oh, Dan Crunion. Come stay. It's the Dan Crunion. Did he bring the chocolate ice cream? I got it right here. Oh, wait. This is vanilla. Vanilla? That's no good. It's so plain. I wanted the chocolate. It wasn't until today that I knew that it was vanilla ice cream all along. Hey, who stole my pie? Was it you? Hey, Grace, come here. Come over to the window. Yeah, yeah, there's something strange going on down there. Something stinky. Yeah. Hey, Dynamic Duo. Are you trekking down that crazy cat, the evil smell switcher? Heck no. We're getting out of town. We can't handle this. Hey, that's not a bad idea. Boy wonder, babe. Have a good day, citizen. Captain's Log, Supplemental. Chief Officer Mr. Spook, Dr. Boynton McCoy, and I, Captain James T. Carp, have beamed onto the planet's surface. <laughs> Strange air on this planet. All of the aromas are mixed up. Bonesy, can you do something? Darn it, Jim. I'm a doctor, not an air freshener. I find your reaction quite fascinating, if I may say so, Captain. <laughs> I remain unaffected by this alteration of odor. Snotty! Beam us out of here. Right away, Captain. Pump up the jam, Chief Inspector. Are you a little monster, Private Eye? That's me. I've got a special delivery for you. Thank you. What could it be? It's the final clue. A clear picture of the handprint we photographed on the Yellow Pappas' refrigerator. Back from the lab at last. Jolly good, Chief Inspector.
It looks like our work is done, chum. Now it is time to gather all the suspects together at Yalapapas Manor. Good show, Chief Inspector. Good show. That evening, we gathered all the suspects together at Yalapapas Manor. I have gathered all of you tonight so that I may reveal the true identity of the evil smell switcher, that smelly criminal, who is at this moment sitting right here in this very room. No way, dude. What are you talking about? Where do you get that stuff from? You're joking, right? What? You're crazy. Is this just another one of your famous hunches? No, it is not. The Chief Inspector and I have evidence to support our case. Speaking of evidence, it is time, Detective Kerplopis. <coughs> Erg, you naughty little monster, you. You missed your appointment today. Well, let's get started, shall we? <coughs> hmm. Two eighties. Hmm. Two seventies. Two feminine. Perfect. I'm a genius. Well, old chum, we should be home just in time for dinner. Gosh, you're right. A quick change out of our crime-fighting costumes, and no one will be the wiser. Holy romper room! Let's casually slide back down. We'll wait in the cave until they're gone. Excuse me, Chief Inspector, Detective, but I'm afraid there's been a bit of a misunderstanding. It seems you have me confused with someone else. Hold it right there, Yally. You don't fool us. No, you hold it, or I'll use my deatomizing laser on you. We all know that's not a deatomizing laser, Yally. It's just a pen. Now sit down. Rat. Yo, yo, we get a boy so tricky, get glad on the side, he's a break and so silly. Yo, what's up, Mickey? Help! Help! You'll have to excuse me. I am needed elsewhere. <laughs> Nice try, Jerry. Hello. 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 Oh, 
money. So listen and learn. Don't play with matches or you're going to get burned. Now listen to me, baby, because I'm no liar. Don't stand too close to the fire. Happy birthday, Detective Kerplapis. Chief Inspector, you shouldn't have. It was the least I could do, Detective. For oh, your smell switching is coming to a close. And I no longer feel forced to hold my nose. The chief and I have gathered you, cause we have the clue. Whoever would have thought that it was. Not yet, Detective. Sorry, Chief Inspector. I got excited. The evil smell switcher is... Psst. If you know who done it, pick out the suspect from the lineup over there. Right. Great going, Detective. He's getting away. Oh, no, he's not. Why did you do it, Jerry Bombanat? It was just a scientific experiment. Next time, keep your experimenting in your lab, Jerry, and leave the noses of Monsterville out of it. You can say that again, Chief Inspector. You're not going to call the cops, are you? No, even worse. We're going to call your mother. No! Well, old chum, it looks as if this case is all wrapped up. Great job, Detective. Why, thank you, Chief Inspector. What are we going to do tomorrow? Hmm. We could play Little Monster, Space Ranger. Could I be the wicked green slobbery thing that ate the world? Sure thing, chum. Splendid. Thanks for helping us solve the mystery. We couldn't have done it without you. See you on the next case, detective. <laughs> Welcome to Mugs. If you want some help, click on me. <laughs> okay, here's the face. Take a good look. Ready, set, go!
Yes, you got it. Right to you. See you soon. <laughs>